there, it's Rachel from All About The House. Um, in this video I'm going to show you how to do multicolored text in Photoshop. So using one color for your text um, is cool, but sometimes multicolored text can really add extra interest to your design. So what I like to do is just type out normally what I would put um, in one color. So put any text that you want, and then to change the color of your text, all you need to do is click on your type tool, left click and drag to highlight one of your letters or you could do two letters if you wanted to. So if I left click and drag I've now got that letter highlighted and now I can change the color of that letter by clicking on this button up the top here and then you can pick from any color on the color picker. So we can see that only one color of our word is changing so purple looks good with green let's hit OK. So we can change the color of each letter in this word if we wanted to so if I did want the X in green I can just leave that one and I can left click and drag on the E. If I wanted to make this one purple as well, I again click that little button up the top here. If I wanted it to be the same purple, I can simply click there and it will color match. So now I have a word with two different colors. If you wanted to do um, three, four, you could do a different color for each letter. If you had multiple words, you could do one word in one color, another word in a different color. There's so many different ways that you can experiment with multicolored text. Um, so if you wanted to left click and drag on another letter and pick a different color from the color picker. So if I wanted this one to be a hot pink and then I've now got multicolored text. Let's go with um, orange, Ooh, yucky orange. Oh, it's so hard to find a nice orange. More of a coral. Yeah, it looks alright. So you could do multicolor text that way. Um, what's really good though for multicolor text is if you go to the swatches menu in Photoshop and then you can use Photoshop's um, pre-selected uh, like color swatches. So I do have another video on how to use the color tools in Photoshop but one of the way to, ways to use the swatches menu is to click this little button here with this drop down arrow and then you can pick a color swatch from the menu. So the default in Photoshop I think is the Pantone Solid Coated. Um, the one that I really like to use is that one plus the Toyo 94 Color Finder. So this one is really good for rainbows. Rainbows are actually way harder like rainbow color schemes to do than you think. And this is um, what that Toyo 94 Color Finder one is. So it's already got all really nice patterns, sorry, really nice um, colors laid out for you. So we've already got all the pinks etc. So if you pick the colors for example vertically um, you can make a really good pattern, a really good rainbow um, color. I also use it for patterns mainly. So we can go with like a nice green and then we could choose a yellow of that same spectrum so that's another good way to use colors as well. So if you do want to use a color all you need to do is hover your mouse over that color, left click and now your foreground color over here will be selected. All you need to do is click on your text tool, left click and drag, and then you can change the color that way by clicking there, or you can click up the top here and click the foreground. So that's how you make multicolored text in Photoshop.